Hi, this is Rick. Uh, I was going to show you a very rare laser. Uh, this module in the diode hit uh, 3.8, set around uh, about 2.45 uh, amps, which is what I set most of my 3 watts on. And uh, this is, like I said, a very rare diode. I went through about 40 modules and happened to find this one hit super high on the meter. Uh, like I said, it spiked uh, 3.8, so I was going to try to catch it on video. Uh, here we go. I'm gonna I've got a piece of cardboard here, so hopefully the the readout on the meter will show up good. Lock them out some of the light. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, make sure we can see everything. Holding at 3.7, that's pretty good. I uh, got the lens focused out a little bit too much. Focus the lens down. I don't know if I, I focused the lens down to a little spot. Let me focus it back out a little bit. Don't want to run it too long. Here it is, holding at 3.6. Starting to drop, so I'm going to turn it off. Uh, the module happening really started getting warm. Let's see here if I can show you a laser. Oh, and I always wear your safety glasses. I try to say that in every video. Uh, let's see if I can show you here. It's only showing like 73 degrees. That's pretty good. This is one of the best heat sinks on the market, I do have to say. Even though I designed them. Uh, over here, the room temperature is at 68.7 um, uh, in Tennessee Marstown it's about I think 1400 uh, feet above sea level here and at 68 degrees I don't have a humidity chart but humidity can play a factor but anyway I thought some guys would like to see this real powerful rare diode I may put it up for bid so if you see the video and like it uh, happy bidding thanks